Hello there and welcome to part uh, 19 I think of uh, <laughs> Ryuko West, it could be part 18 uh, Just me messing around, it's been a little while since recorded so uh, If memory serves me right uh, uh, We uh, can see the defeat against Castile and it's currently plotting to take uh, Bihar out in the war uh, If I remember also right, we could end up in trouble with Delai but uh, I think we should be alright, hopefully so uh, we'll go ahead and uh, start trying to maneuver troops into position for uh, attack, especially in uh, especially in this area. So we can just uh, move them straight onto, uh, drop them right onto Bihar, so that we don't have to actually sacrifice something extra, so to speak. So uh, without any further ado, we'll uh, <laughs> we'll get started. Government Tank 11 was just reached, and with it, another idea to. Uh, Try and combat real risk, we'll actually go for a tolerance of hiddens. We should probably take a quest for the new world so we could... No, sorry. Uh, we have no need for quest for the new world, we'll... Uh, we'll get to we'll get to westernization when uh, we get there, it's still quite a while away. We need two more slider moves, so we'll go for humanist tolerance, which gives a plus two to hiddens. And seeing as I'm an animist, I think everyone are hiddens. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, everyone is seen to me, so uh, we have the tolerance up to zero, so uh, it should help a little bit, although uh, not that much. This could actually become a real uh, a real option, but uh, we'll have to see. For now, it doesn't really matter. Then I'm more on trade income, at least 30%. Uh, it's now at about 20... 18, 19%, so probably won't happen, unfortunately. Uh, since I don't know what I want to invest in now, we'll simply invest about the same in everything. And we'll also quit this mission and see if we get something else. Remove Mastra. Mm, we actually got a quite. We got a wonderful mission. Um, let's see here, it's this one. Della is the defender of the. Allied with Sind, Admagar Deccan, Rajputana. Well, if the Allies stays out of that, it should be quite nice. Uh, we'll actually try and see what happens. If, uh, well, if the Allies ends up joining into this war, we'll have to uh, have to deal with Bihar some somewhere somewhere else. But uh, hopefully, we'll be able to keep the light out of it and uh, well what I want to do is actually just try and do a quick grab with a quick siege so we'll go ahead take a chance declare war and move our troops straight over Rajputana, Sindh so if we are lucky these guys actually didn't we'll actually call them into this war <laughs> now my plan is starting to take form I call them into this war I think I'm war leader I am. And with this, we can now declare a war on these guys, in which Delai cannot do anything against me. <laughs> My evil plan is being formed. And I like it. Uh, Punjab has been called in. They're small, I think. Yeah, they're small. Hopefully, I'll be able to annex, annex that little state to... Yeah. I'm actually also... Siege leader here. I, the ally didn't help me, so we'll attach two siege units, which will send north to Kandesh and Makastra, and hopefully I'll be able to siege them on my own. Yeah, and once I actually siege this province, uh, we should be should be set. I think. I think I should have to send some up to <laughs> boost their Bihar. Is once again creating trouble, but oh, I feel bad for Malacca. <laughs> uh, it's also kind of weird seeing as they actually have a uh, cult here, so they should have been rich and been able to prevent this. But with this, Makastar has been uh, given a second chance, and apparently they uh, they are taking it. So it will be interesting to see how things turn out. But uh, as you might imagine, uh, up here. Things are going quite well for me. I will be, uh, I will be annexing these three provinces, 
and with them we should be able to uh, and then we'll declare war as I said on uh, on Bihar and simply take this opportunity to uh, to create trouble for them too also created some new armies here 12 new which will send to the northwestern uh, area yeah I'll be calling it the northwestern area if you hate it then you do uh, but uh, don't bother telling me because I'll probably just ignore it if you do still uh, no I'm not I'm kidding if you uh, hate it, hate it that I call it in the western area just say so and I'll start calling it something else that really doesn't matter that much to me but uh, yeah we'll try to do some uh, effective infamy burning here so uh, Russia Putana is negotiated for themselves we can can allow them to just get out this I don't want no I want those guys so we'll keep them in Raj Putana I'm letting out Punjab too probably if uh, they want to I can actually demand a tribute yeah I would actually gain I would actually gain uh, gain from that so uh, that I can peace out themselves whenever they feel like it for my for my <laughs> uh, as far as I I am concerned Still, I need some army leaders, and probably will get this later. Is is fine. I don't know what kind of troops Bihar has, but uh, probably not that great. We'll split this one in half and place four here and four here. And uh, no, we'll actually place two in each and uh, twelve here. So uh, yeah, it's time to uh, repent. Let's see here, will Dela join? They will. So we'll go ahead and uh, declare this war as well. 2 mat thousand here, 2,000 there, 12,000 uh, here I think. And well, these guys should probably have given a, uh, a slightly sooner warning. But uh, yeah, Korea joined in, they'll probably just siege Okinawa as they usually do. And basically not create any trouble whatsoever for me. So. Uh, yeah, this will be interesting battle to see if we can actually uh, actually try and uh, if we, as soon as we kill these troops, we basically killed off everything they have. So it will be interesting to see how uh, how this turns out. Commissioning privateers, we actually won that battle without too many losses. So uh, yeah, all in all, I am uh, I'm happy with my troops now. So uh, siege of much. Maharashtra, I sorry, it's over. I totally butchered that word, so uh, I'm sorry. There we go, Bihar troops, no more. And with this, we I'll send those guys over there. Uh, send three thousand men down there. These guys will be split in half and sent there. You can stay at home. And otherwise, not really much happening, I think. Let's see here, there should be stable government. Seeing as we've just reached a government technology, I think. Yeah, we'll only lose 600, so we'll go ahead and accept that. Uh, these guys are slowly moving to where we want them to. I should probably build some ships, though, to deal with privateers like this one. But uh, Castile or someone else will probably come by soon enough and uh, kill them for me. But, well, should probably not get my hopes too high up. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, these sieging armies are f fairly enough in size, so uh, we'll just keep them in the country in case of rebels. I want to annex these guys first, and then uh, annex these guys. And uh, that way we'll hopefully fully get uh, what we want. And also I'll burn some uh, infamies a little bit more effectively. And since I'm also talking about being effective, I should probably uh, start using my magistrates without, without them just... Uh, Rothing there, and we'll go ahead and boost our manpower a little bit, and see if we can actually make our our economy just a tiny, whiny little bit better. So uh, it'll be interesting to see how this turns out. But since the only thing that remains is sieges, and I have been uh, talking non-stop for a while, I'll uh, go ahead and deal with uh, both the sieges and these new rebels of mine. Well, sorry, you're already back. Uh, Time for some annexations, we'll annex those guys, and we'll finish up our mission with uh, annexing these guys, there we go. 
in the core and basically we simply got it for free now that I think about it, my bad but uh, what will our new mission be? Save Orissa which is currently what we're about to do I don't think I have that much war exhaustion either nope, <laughs> we'll pretty much get rid of all of our war exhaustion with this and it will be, uh, be quite nice we'll keep Shiatsu Ho for uh, as long as he's alive so considering that I should probably stop using him in uh, in battle zones, but uh, yeah, let's see here. We will be dealing with these rebels and the Gorka. The only thing that remains now is Bihar, so uh, we'll pull these guys, uh, pull these guys out to Utsang, and uh, we'll soon go down to Golkanda too and uh, and deal with the other ones. Punjab will pay. Yeah, they're all also coating it just for. Uh, just for himself, so we'll go ahead and accept that. We'll also offer Sind a. Uh, we'll actually demand that they give up, of course. Nope. We'll demand that they. We'll actually go ahead and get uh, Vinagiar back just for. just for fun. I think they'll actually become animist. But you know what? We'll, we'll allow them to offer the deal they want. We'll get a few cash and. A few coins, which should be enough. Complete our mission to save Orissa. We'll... Yeah, naval race again. Seriously, don't you have anything better for me? But uh, seeing as we have more provinces among with docks now, I think that will uh, that should uh, work it great. Let's see here. Uh, nope. <laughs> Still only eight at support limits, so uh, won't be seeing that much of an army. Portugal is here. Uh, which is kind of spooky, but uh, with a new super army we can deal with anyone except Europeans and, well, basically everyone who isn't our neighbor, so, uh, well, it will be an interesting time ahead, as you can perhaps imagine, but uh, we should be alright. Uh, currently, Okinawa is being sieged, doesn't really matter, I think Bihar will fall first move these guys over to just help out a little bit and uh, well I'll uh, siege Bihar and then I'll get back to you well Bihar is completely sieged and I kind of feel the evil flowing through me when I see this I can annex them and of course I will do that with this Ryuku is great Ryuku is huge Ryuku has their own trade center which I unfortunately can't destroy well I would have preferred it to be by lake in terms of the colonization of well, these small islands it seems, but uh, hey, everything can't work out exactly as you want it. I'll uh, keep one army in uh, Bihar itself for uh, defensive purposes. Move this army uh, down here, I think. Better coverage. And well, we uh, have a crappy infamy now. And Dila ain't that fond of us anymore, so we'll give them a little bit of cash. Should be enough. And. Uh, We'll see for peace, we'll demand... Heck, I, I don't really know what to demand from these guys. We'll do this. And this, I think. No, I don't care if they actually take them back, so we'll go, just go ahead with that. War's over, we can relax. Delight didn't get any gains, and... Well, all in all, we uh, strengthen ourselves considerably, and... I'd go as far as to say that uh, these ser two wars right now has uh, been on the same level of uh, ecstasy for me as uh, the draw against Ming uh, that we had earlier. Uh, right now I think I should be able to stand better up against Ming, but if they attack they have so many troops on my border that they'll probably overrun most of uh, the easternmost lands here. So if Ming attacks now, I'm probably in a worse position than I was originally, especially considering that there will be a bunch, and then I mean a real bunch of uh, rebels running around here quite soon. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll have to see. These guys are actually allied with Ming, which is scary in its own right. Uh, allied with only Deccan. Surprising, huh? Well, we uh, this will have to be the end of this episode. We. Uh, did a great war, we uh, got what we wanted, we are currently being very good at expanding these last episodes and uh, hopefully we'll be able to do it in uh, in the same speed. So uh, 
Thank you for watching. I hope you really hope you have enjoyed it. Please leave a comment, some praise, criticism, anything you feel like, really. And uh, hopefully, I'll see you next time. Bye.